Hi everyone and welcome. In this review note, we're going to start increasing the security on our switch device that we've been configuring. Right now I'm connected to my switch in user exec mode. I'm going to begin by changing to privilege mode. And you'll notice that there's been no challenge for any kind of credentials or any kind of authentication to get into our privilege mode, which is not something that's good. So we're gonna change that now. Change into global config mode. And what we're going to do is set a password for when we change from user exec to privileged exec mode. To do that, we use the enable command. If I look at the options here, we can do a couple different things. One is to change the algorithm type that we're going to use to hash the password. We can also specify a plain password or we can also use the keyword secret and what secret will do is actually hash the password for us. What we're going to do is two things. One is change the algorithm type and the other is specify what the hashed password is. Now the reason we're going to change the algorithm is the default is MD5, which is no longer secure. So we're going to change that to SHA-256. How do we do that? I'm going to AL for algorithm, tab that out. Question mark, what are our options? We're going to say SHA-256. And then the other thing we'll do is say secret and then type in what our password is going to be. So our command is enable. That's our command. We're changing the algorithm type to SHA-256. Secret means we're going to hash the password and the password we're going to hash is secret 55. Press enter. That's now done. If we want to see the result of that, we can look in our configuration file, our running configuration file, to look at that value or, or what we've just done. If we want to look at that, we can display the part of the running configuration that will show us what we've just done. What this command says we're going to do is show the running config, and then we're going to include all lines that have the string enable in them. And here's the result. So we see our command is enable. Secret says we're going to hash the value that we put in for the password. Eight is the index of the hashing algorithm. And what we see here on the end is the hashed value of secret 55. That's all we have to do for that. If I now exit out to show what happens with this, Now changing from user exec mode to privileged exec mode, I'm going to be prompted for a password. Type in secret 55 and I'm into privileged exec mode. That's a wrap for the video. Hopefully this has been helpful for you and we'll see you next time.